actually been such a long time since I've actually logged on to Wiz. Not really, because I mean, I just streamed the other day, but what I'm saying is, it's been a long time since I've, you know, just tinkered around and actually did some, some, some good old Wiz head stuff. Ah! Like, honestly, I don't even know if my plants are alive. Like, I, I generally don't know. Like, I think there's a way that you can tell if they're alive or dead. I mean, no, no, no. There is a way that you can tell if they're alive or dead, right? But they can't die if you don't log on, I think, or if you don't go to the house. Um, I don't know. I really don't know how it works. If you guys know how it works, let me know down in the comments section down below. Because whenever I go for away for a long time and I come back, my plants are never really dead. One time they were dead, and I was so scared that I was going to lose all my seeds. And I was so glad they weren't. But, like, they were, like, in the, like, the red zone, like, right there. They were in, like, the red zone, not, like, the green zone. So, like, I was like, oh, my God. Oh, please don't, don't wither. It is, in fact, double garden rewards, and, um, um, is it the last day? It is, in fact, the last day for gardening rewards, so that's great. I get to get double, uh, snacks, right? That's cool, that's cool. That's, that's really what a lot of people want from double gardening rewards, but, um, no, I actually hate this gardening reward because, I mean, it's so good at first. Like, at first, it's, like, just the greatest freaking reward, right? It's, like, amazing. Like, you have, like, probably, like, what, 12 in Mega Peas. You get double that from that, so it's, like, 24. And then you get double that, it's, like, 48. And then it's, like, it's like it just keeps on going up and up and up and up and up. You get all this gold. You get all this free agents. You get all this stuff, right? It's short-lived. Like, <laughs> like honestly, it's short-lived, dude. Like, I'm honestly sick and tired of this freaking member benefit, dude. Like, at first, it was great, like, when I had, like, one plot full of, like, um... EMP was like, I was like, oh my god, I'm great, I'm gonna be able to make two plots, three plots, four plots, and it's gonna be great, I can transfer from all of my characters, it's gonna be amazing, but now, dude, like, it's so repetitive, and it doesn't, I don't wanna say it comes up often, because, I mean, it doesn't come up that often, I'm not gonna lie, but I mean, when it comes up, it makes me not even wanna freaking garden it, and like, I don't know how to really explain this, but like, when you've been gardening for such a long time, right, and you get used to, like, having, like, a ton of snacks and stuff, when you don't really need to, like, garden like every week or every day it kind of becomes like really repetitive really fast so like you gotta sell all these tc that you get for emps you get like cleanse charm earthquake tower shield poison and i think it's like some guarding tc and pierce my bad you get all this gold it's great amazing but at first but then once you start getting max tc and max gold and you can't sell them anymore and you gotta start trashing them or whatever the f you gotta do to get rid of them it gets really hard to like really manage this stuff if you don't play that often that is ah! so what i'm basically trying to say is that like double garden xp is good for a certain extent right because like once you get it once or twice or three times you're set for like the entire rest of like your, your whole like game career look at my freaking backpack face dude it's that like 150 out of 150 usually when it's like double gardening xp dude that thing goes up from like 250 to out of 150 dude and i know that you could like buy space now i think but that doesn't even really help that much look at my bank 388 out of 150 i can't put sh in my bank because it's freaking full and that's ridiculous dude. like and i know what you guys are all gonna say michael just put your seeds in your seed vault and then you'll be straight now would you look at this so i put all of my seeds in there right and it's double gardening xp so it's like that one plot that i took away counts as both of these so i put one of them in and then the other half is still in my bank and i still have how much space left i have about like what 40 or 34 or 36 space once i do this one that one's gonna be at max and then my freaking bank is gonna be at max as well but yo let's just uh keep going right let's just uh get get ourselves to max gold max tc max everything right because i know my boy zeke's about to pop up any freaking second like oh looks like you've picked up a little bit more than than you can carry and then yep there he goes no that's uh that's the other guy for the tc that's uh that's the lincoln i think you gotta get rid of some gold you gotta start buying some, some there, there he goes <laughs> both of them wow it's great and then sometimes with this member benefit dude my freaking one i don't know if it's just my computer or whatever L look i still have all of these left to, to redeem but i can't even redeem them you know why because i just took on more than i can carry i guess okay so we're back and we're redeeming more we still have so much left to do dude like this is a hassle and i normally don't garden mostly because i don't want to freaking have to worry about all this and I need my um, energy when I um, train pets and stuff. But you know what? Sometimes I just buckle down and just play with someone for like an hour just handling plants. All right, so we're gonna put as much as we can here, which is uh, I think the max is 36, yep. So this this entire vault is full. It's at 100, max capacity, 100 out of 100. Great, awesome, amazing, cool. Now let's go check our bank once again to see how bad that's gotten. So our bank is at the total of 468 out of 150. 
That's a lot of stuff. That's a lot of seeds. And I barely have anything in my bank besides freaking seeds. 55 pages full of seeds and every page has eight seeds. Here's what I do with my snacks all the time to see how many I've collected. I have max freaking catching cantaloupes. I can't even move those. I have max cherry tomatoes. I can't even move those. I have 227 fancy air goods. So I'll just move those and I'll have a little bit more. Max golden wheat bread. We're almost at max mystic dragon fruit, which is crazy. And we're max at pretty much everything else besides fancy yogurt, which is like the hardest one. But I mean, yeah, we have enough snacks, right? Gardening, I don't even garden for snacks anymore, dude. I just garden just for the freaking, the fun of it, honestly. Like, I'm pretty fine with the amount of snacks I have. Unless I want to get more fancy yogurts and I'll probably get like 10 of those or 20 of those after every harvest. So it's not a terrible system, right? Ugh, dude, like, I wish there was just like a set amount that you could like have in your bank. So where like it won't pick up that much of like a certain item anymore if that makes any sense because like what if i was like farming hades randomly farming hades and then like i get the amulet of divine god even though i already have the amulet of divine swag <laughs> but let's say i was on a different character right and i just and i just so happen to get the amulet of divine influence dude but my backpack space is full so i'm like oh okay dude i'll just get it from my bank go ahead and check my bank and it's not there because my bank is full I'm missing out on the rarest drop in the entire game because my bank is full because of double gardening. That's ridiculous. And you need to make it so to where you can quick sell crowns items or you could like, you know, I started something crazy, but like, what if you could like quick sell crowns items and get like a certain amount of crowns back for them? That would be pretty sick. So like you're questing, you get like a ton of pink dandelions and like you have like a bunch of them in your bank. You know, like, say, like, you have, like, 20 of them, and you, like, quick sell them all, and you get, like, 20 crowns. Even though it's not a lot of crowns, that's still a good, like, way to, like, balance it out, you know what I'm saying? But even just the quick sell plants feature would be a great addition to the game. And it would be a minor one, but so helpful, just like the, um, the quick sell TC one. It's so helpful. Just so I wouldn't have to dread double gardening every time it pops up, you know what I'm saying? Because sometimes I dread it, like, oh, I gotta do this again, or I just don't do it, and I just miss out on the entire reward because I don't want to have to worry about doing all this and i know you guys are like no michael why don't you just trash them all you can just it's way quicker but i want to get my pet up to mega so that's just the l that i have to take but i mean in the beginning it was great the only good like really good um member benefit with like no drawbacks at all is freaking double pet xp and double pet xp is like the best one honestly like i don't know anybody who would complain about double pet xp now imagine i know this is probably quicker on video but i just wasted like probably like 30 or 40 minutes just doing these two and i have to still replant them right now imagine, I have to do that, and then I have to do that on this character, this character, even though they're not Elia, which is so great for me, you guys understand, and this character, and I was just too lazy to even make two plots in this character because I was just so tired of it. Don't ask me why I planted Elia Elephant Ears, just, just don't do it. In short, this member benefit at first was the greatest thing that I've ever experienced ever as a member benefit, but now it's just really repetitive and with a few slight changes not to the member benefit but to the game itself this member benefit would be more convenient to use if they were implemented but most likely they're probably not going to do it and if they do they're probably going to do it a while from now and while we're on the topic dude the quick sell crowns item thing might not be as far away as we think because i mean they've already added quick sell tc which i thought they would never do because i mean i think they wanted people to run back to the freaking bizarre to add more freaking playtime to their freaking list but i mean i guess not this might be a thing that comes in the future but what i don't think is i think that they won't add like the like the quick sell and you get like um crowns from it because i mean that's just crazy people would probably just farm for like dandelions all day or something like that and just try to try to rack up on crowns items and you get crowns items pretty frequently so i mean i don't think that they would actually do that but it would be really cool if they did but that's just really my take on the member benefit as of late dude i mean i saw a pretty popular youtuber <laughs> make a video about the same topic so i was like you know what let me ride the clout for a little bit but um yeah guys if you guys did enjoy this video make sure to let me know down in the comment section down below dude if you guys like this member benefit or if you guys have problems with member benefits in general certain ones maybe not this one maybe a different one let me know down in the comment section down below i'm really curious i love to read what you guys have to tell me and, um, yeah, if you guys can get this video to at least, I don't know, like, what, one like, I'd really appreciate it, dude. We're trying to come back. We're trying to make Wiz lit. So, yeah. Also, if you guys didn't know, I changed my description up a little bit. So, if you guys want to follow me on Snapchat, Twitter, Instagram, Twitch, anything at all, Patreon, sub, maybe, I don't know. But if you guys want to do that, links, as always, are in the description down below. It'd be really lit if you guys just check me out on my other, like, you know, social medias. And, uh, that's really about it, guys. Um, love you guys all so very much, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Silly guys.